the HLA DQ and DQ8 tests is a, is a very interesting test. Uh, now, research shows that if someone has these particular genes, that their risk of developing celiac disease is increased. Now, celiac disease is when the body's immune system mistakes the lining of the intestinal tract. It mistakes it as a foreign invader, so the immune system goes and attacks it. Now, this particular test uh, is not a direct test for celiac disease. Uh, some tests that help in uh, aiding uh, and finding out whether the autoimmune process is actually activated and going on are a few tests called a transglutaminase test uh, and an anti-endomesial antibody test. Those two tests help to see if the you know, autoimmune process is actually going on. But the genetic test can be done at any age to find out risk. Now, of course, being very proactive with health in our clinic, if these genes show up, we're going to recommend that that person not that that person avoids gluten-containing foods uh, because it can promote the issues later on in life. Right? Traditional from a traditional pro approach, you already have to have the auto the celiac disease process going on for anything to be done. And of course, we want to be proactive. So looking at this particular genetic test is a very powerful way to get ahead of the problems that can go along with celiac disease down the line. So it's a great test. It can be done by a swab, a cheek swab, uh, and it can be done at any age. So it's, it's a very powerful test. And we use this test uh, quite often in our practice to really hammer in the fact that someone needs to stay away from gluten-containing foods.